Yo, what is up, bros? We are back with our big map, how France could have won the war uh, playthrough. And what we have found out is that if Italy was incompetent, which they were, and if uh, France would have attacked through the last uh, spot anybody would have expected, through the Maginot Line, come storming out of the Maginot Line, who would have expected the French to attack from their static defensive line? Nobody. And that's why it worked. And now, the Gaul is going to be taking Konigsberg. Because nobody can stop him. Except a city with a bunch of health. Yeah, who knew Konigsberg had so much health? I did not. So we do got this group of German generals that we've got to take out. We got a model that is stupid. We got a model that is dead. Damn. They're not going to have too many generals left after this. Oh. Hold on, didn't they already have a Manstein? Or is that the first one? It they had to have had another Manstein, right? Because how would he have full health? It's it's round 13 and he has full health. There had to be another one. I'll have to look back through the video. That doesn't make sense. Okay, so we were dropping bros out of here. I think, didn't we use up everybody? I think we'd used up everybody. Except the Americans who I thought we might use. But I really don't think we're going to need them, so... Probably not going to use them. Let me check here real quick. Do we have anybody left? Just artillery generals. Yeah, we got three uh, artillery generals, I guess. We can throw down artillery. So that's another point how France could have won the war. Spam artillery. Attack through the Maginot Line. And count on the Italians being incompetent. Which is a sure bet. Speaking of the Italians... Who have left their capital completely unguarded. Because that is... That is in the Italian strategy book. It's kind of like how the French did it. They attacked where nobody expected them. But then they also didn't defend at all. Where everybody would have expected them. They were trying to use reverse psychology. It didn't work. And uh, the f Italian homeland has been taken. Another page out of the Italian strategy book. Make sure you use up all your manpower completely stupidly. Don't defend. Attack where even, attack where even if you won, it doesn't help you at all. So we're going to have, we're going to have a meeting. Holy shit. What is this line of troops? That is ridiculous. So I started sneaking up these uh, French troops out of Syria. Try to get started in the Caucasus. Greece always does pretty well. Is there any other mod where Greece does really good? I can't think of one. Oh, we get a general down here doubting. 
Hey, that reminds me, I didn't put anything up here, did I? No, I didn't use a general. Uh, bro, you're up. The only real challenge we got now is beating the Soviet Union to Berlin. That's going to be the goal. Ground troops to ground troops. I'm not going to cheat with air power. First to Berlin wins Berlin. Week 14. And we'll just start out with what's supposed to be our Berlin attack force. Wow. I sent like the crappiest generals I had up there, I guess. I mean, besides the goal. Goal will always be amazing. Do not dare say a bad word about the goal. Not to mention, we got two de Gaulle's. So, yeah, watch out. Look at that. No one. Is there no one that is left in Europe that could possibly stop the French? Oh, yeah. The Soviets have done it before. Look at Guderian. He's still up here alive. They still got a couple generals just thrown around. Keep holding them up, bros. Papagos, where are you heading, bro? We're, we've we won over here. You're going the wrong way. I'll go ahead and open this up. You know what? Okay, that's what I was looking for. I was looking to make sure Boris was located where he was because you you've got to be aware of where Boris is at the second you lose track of where Boris is at your war is over Boris will bring it unlike any other Boris I've ever known okay we've got issues here We've got troops behind the line. Well, let's just focus on Meinstein. That was a nice 300 hit from De Gaulle. Maybe we brought enough firepower. Oh, he's stupid. Yep, yeah, we got him stupid. And he still got a little over half health. Or a little below half. There was a time that we controlled Brussels. That time has now returned. And now... Our drive on Berlin is coming from two directions. The Germans have no answer. And Italy is just about to lose. Yeah, they're what? Third to last city that they have left. End of week 14. Week 15. And this right here could be the week. Where all German offensive capability is ruined. Yep. It's done. No more offensive capability. I mean, there is a leave, a lone leave. A leave without his bros. 
is not really a dangerous leap. And this fat ass is never dangerous, so we ain't worried about him. He gets hit once, finds out his food supply truck got hit, and he goes stupid. We don't have to worry about him. Yep. Food supply truck was hit. He went into a fit of rage and passed out because he hadn't ate in two hours. Alright, well, I guess Lubzig is up next. We're just going to have to count on some forces we drop down here to hold. Can you hold? The Germans are defending in the wrong area. They're still not convinced that the... It's like... It's like D-Day. They're still not convinced the attack is really happening here. They just thought it would come from much closer. Uh, let's hit Budapest and we'll take that. Let's say what's up to Tito. Yo, what's up, Tito? Is there anything around that's like one, one hit? This is probably one hit. That's gonna put us... Yep. Bros. France is officially a part of the Eastern Front. They have arrived. France getting nice and thick. We're just gonna bypass this. capture Benghazi before the Egyptians. Maybe. Got it. And then there was but one city under Italian control in North Africa. Week 16! And now in the 16th week of warfare. The Germans are really going to feel the wrath of the French army. Who at this point doesn't even care about the generals they've got left. They're just pressing the attack. If they happen to pass a general, sure, they'll whack them. But it's really of no importance. We're just not concerned with the, um, the generals that Germany has left. I'm just shocked at... This is what I'm shocked at. Guderian is still alive and... <laughs> And somehow Keitel just captures Warsaw right out from underneath the Soviets. Oh shit. They're at Berlin. We gotta get this open. That's close enough. Just like Italy, the French came in with a uh, better, uh-oh, uh-oh, hey look at this, thanks for doing uh, me a solid there, actually. Is that open to? Open enough. Well, if it wasn't official before, it's official now. We're gonna have some ru- Hold on, is that open? Yeah, that's definitely going to put us in direct contact with the- So look at this thickness! Unorthodox thickness! But thickness nonetheless. 
I like my thickness unorthodox. Is there no stopping? The French thickness. Is pond? Don't tell me Ponson is open. Can I get to that? I know this has really good range. You know what? I mean, if it's in... If it's within a hit or two, I'm using air power. That has to piss him off. Hold on. Is this just... Yeah, we're going to take those two. We'll be cutting off the uh, Soviet supply. You know, there's some type of little odd, like, truce going on here. With Guderian and um, Bach and Kesselring and Brauschwitz and Mannerheim. Yeah, that's really unorthodox thickness. And say goodbye to the Italian presence in Africa. Actually, just completely say goodbye to Italy. Week 17. How in the hell did that happen? Goring. I know, I kind of know what happened. He heard there was a, a food depot. A food distribution center set up in Brussels. It was like, um, all you can eat sauerkraut. And not, no amount of French generals or French troops could hold him back. You think you can keep... You think you can keep goring off the sauerkraut? Not a chance. Not a damn chance. Look... I think that sh that should be the first French death by the common turn. Oh, I thought we had a deal. There was like a white piece that we'd both focus on the Soviet Union first. And you attack me. Like, this is 100% accurate. Exactly how it would have went down. We still got Boris to worry about, though, and that is... That's causing me... Well, they didn't put down a general. Shockingly. Just thinking about having to take on... Boris. Got the sweats. There's actually another city almost open if I can reach it. And I can. And then there's this. Ch check it out. The Soviet supply line is completely cut. Their entire force cut off from supplies. Noise. Well, that is some... That's a little bit of border gore. All right, what are we? Week 17. And this is going to be a wrap. Bros. If you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the like and subscribe with the notification bell. And I will see you back here for our next upload. Peace. Ruminati out.